So as we're entering the festival area, as you go through these gates, these symbolic gates, you kind of clear your past devils and your past uh, just bad things that kind of linger. And so clearing this symbolically clears you of anything that is negative in your life. И сперва говорим, просим Ирин Тойанаи, что мы этот год прожили очень хорошо, удачно, и следующий год у нас был благосклонен к успеху. Mm -hmm. Вот и все. И вот бросаем, смотри, как он горит. Welcome, everybody. I'm in the Republic of Sakha, which is the largest republic in all of Russia. And I'm just outside of the city of Yakutsk at a very special festival called Essekh. It takes place over the course of two days and it invites all the local native population, the people that were originally here before the Russians came 386 years ago, give or take. The festival celebrates a friendship and it establishes a tradition of trust and it kind of encourages everyone to get together and make peace and also have luck and prosperity developed from this wonderful festival. So let's enjoy the festival. Hapsagai is the national sport of wrestling, and as I love challenges, I had to give it a try. <laughs> Let's 
National symbol, something you'll see all over the place, especially here in Essek, are horses. And let me just state, the whiter or the kind of more tan they are, the more rare they are. So it makes them not only really valuable, but kind of appreciated by the local people. Now, the mythology states that the first person to discover the kind of territory rode in on a horse, which is why they are revered and so important. Also, the horse hair, the meat, and the fur, or the skin, is really important for the manufacturing of textiles or for musical instruments or, or for just eating consumption. Uh, really important animal and make sure that you pay attention to it. The outfits worn by locals and visitors are often unique. The jewelry and accessories are intricate and can be made of horsehair or silver. There's meaning behind the symbols. Some of them represent protection, while others are talismans for luck and prosperity. Hey everyone, so it's 12.40 in the morning. We are going to the sunrise uh, part of the festival right now. At 3 a.m. the sun will rise and at that point um, everyone gathers one last time to kind of uh, say thanks and also gather that energy from the sun for like a positive time and like a happy new year and things like that. So we're headed back over there one more time. Let's go. Okay, it's 3 a.m. The festival has finally ended. We are now going home to get some sleep. It's been a 25-hour day so far. See you later. Oh yeah, I married a Nevin girl. <laughs> <laughs> 